This DNews episode is brought to you by Domain.com. Top six new species of the year. Let's do this. <laughs> Hey everybody, I'm Trace Dominguez. And I'm Matt Lieberman filling in for D News. Scientists around the world have made great strides this year in the identification and classification of new species. And here is a list of our six favorite finds in 2014. First up is the Hoosier Cavefish. This eyeless sea creature is the first new species described and classified from the United States in 40 years. First discovered in Indiana, it's named after the Indiana Hoosiers and most notably has its anus directly behind its head. Gross, yes, cool, definitely, funny, always. Trace, it's basically got crap for brains. Mm. If you like that one, then this next mammal will be right up your alley. The black-tailed Antichinus, a marsupial found in southeastern Australia, is best known for males of the species mating furiously until they literally die of stress. It's a lot of stress. The females collect their sperm from their late lovers all season long and then birth broods that have multiple fathers. Maury Povich wishes he had guests with this much drama. You are the father, and you are the father, and you're, oh, you're all dead, aren't you? Oh. Hmm. Check out these mushrooms. Look, look harder. Now look again. They aren't mushrooms at all, but animals found off the coast of Australia back in 1986, but they defied description until recently. Dendrogramma enigmatical, as they are now known, may be among some of the oldest animals living on the planet. The gelatinous creatures actually have a mouth at the base of their stalk, and the opaque branches on its upper disc are its long digestive canal. Strange ancient mushroom jellies? That actually sounds pretty delicious. I'd have some. Less delicious, though, is our next candidate, a type of carnivorous sponge found deep underwater. I very much dislike this already, Matt. Yeah. Seriously? Mm -hmm. These scary sponges are covered in microscopic hooks that trap unsuspecting prey, including small crustaceans and my nightmares. Seven types of carnivorous meat-loving sponges have been found to date, and they all engulf and ingest their captive crustaceans within a very few short hours. Just another reason to get out of your shell, anyone? No? No. Got it. It's okay. A new species of katydid was also discovered this year in the rainforests of Ecuador and Colombia, respectively. The so-called supersonus produces the highest frequency calls ever found in nature, likely developed as a defense mechanism. Supersonus evolved without the ability to fly, and their tiny wings are unable to help them flee from potential predators, such as bats. The males also send out the loudest, highest-pitched mating calls in nature, which makes me wonder why we didn't hear these clarion carnal cries much, much earlier. And finally, mm. New York City is home to a brand new species of leopard frog, only the second new kind of frog discovered in the continental US in the last 30 years. It baffled many as it hid in plain sight in one of the most densely populated cities on the planet until now. The frog, designated Rana Caffeldi, is named after herpetologist Carl Caulfeld, who predicted that this frog would exist in the mid 20th century. It's notable for its call, a single pulse chuck, unlike the longer snore-like call of most common frogs. Hmm. So what animal discoveries delighted you this year? Let us know down in the comments below. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. I'm Matt Lieberman, filling in. I'm Trace. Come find us on Twitter. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs>